Apple TV 4K gets tvOS 26 update, full breakdown of new features, hidden changes, and what you need to try in 2025 Apple has now officially rolled out the long-awaited tvOS 26 update for Apple TV 4K and Apple TV HD. And while at first glance it might appear like just another routine software refresh, in reality, this release represents one of the most meaningful leaps forward for Apple's living room strategy in years. Because it doesn't simply polish the interface, it pushes the Apple TV further into becoming the centerpiece of your home entertainment ecosystem, a device that ties together streaming, gaming, music, smart home control, and even social features like FaceTime into one seamless hub. The first and most noticeable change in tvOS 26 is the introduction of Apple's new liquid glass design language, a design philosophy that has already reshaped iOS 19, iPadOS 19, and macOS Sequoia with its translucent panels, layered depth, floating icons, and an almost futuristic fluidity that feels alive. And while the Apple TV already had a modern interface, tvOS 26 takes it further by cleaning up Control Center so it looks nearly identical to what you're used to on iPhone, revamping FaceTime so it mirrors the iOS design and feels natural on a large display, and stripping away unnecessary clutter so menus fade faster and playback remains fully immersive, which may sound subtle but completely changes the mood when you're watching a movie or TV show. Since the interface is now designed to disappear into the background and let your content shine, this is Apple's philosophy in action. Rather than overwhelming users with visual noise, tvOS 26 focuses on simplicity, clarity, and immersion, aligning perfectly with Apple's long-standing mantra that great design is invisible when it needs to be. And when you combine this with the way Apple has unified design across devices, your iPhone, iPad, Mac, and Apple TV now feel like they belong to one continuous experience rather than separate products. Moving beyond design, another critical feature in tvOS 26 that changes the day-to-day -day experience for households is the AirPlay default audio upgrade, which addresses one of the longest-running frustrations Apple TV users have had. In the past, if you wanted to use external speakers like a stereo pair of HomePods or AirPlay-compatible Sonos systems as your main TV audio, you had to manually reconnect them each time your Apple TV woke from sleep, creating an annoying cycle of extra steps every time you just wanted to watch a movie. But now with tvOS 26, you can go into settings of video and audio and permanently set any AirPlay speaker as your default output, which means that if you have a premium Dolby Atmos setup with two HomePods behind your couch or a Sonos surround sound system in your living room, your Apple TV will always remember that configuration delivering rich audio automatically without interruptions. This small sounding change is in fact transformative because it turns the Apple TV from being just a video streamer into a true home theater hub, capable of anchoring high quality setups without friction. And it gives Apple a serious competitive advantage over Roku, Amazon Fire Stick or Chromecast, which still struggle with seamless multi-speaker integration. For families, audiophiles or anyone who is invested in a premium speaker system, tvOS 26 finally makes Apple TV the kind of device you can set once and forget, giving you reliable cinema-grade audio every time you press play. The entertainment upgrades don't stop there. Apple Music Sing also receives one of its biggest upgrades since launch, turning Apple TV into a surprisingly powerful karaoke machine and social experience generator. While the feature already existed, it was limited to basic lyric-following sing-alongs. But with tvOS 26, you can now pair your iPhone as a microphone by scanning a simple QR code on your TV, instantly transforming your phone into a wireless karaoke mic that not only captures your voice, but also lets you control playback. Adjust vocals and choose songs. And Apple has gone further by giving this feature its own dedicated sing icon right on the Apple TV home screen, meaning no more hunting through menus to find it. Once activated, you'll discover curated sing playlists across genres, pop, rock, classics, even party anthems, making it easy to get a group going. And Apple has even added an on-screen visualizer that pulses, shifts, and animates with the beat of the song, turning your living room into a concert stage or dance floor. Whether you're singing Backstreet Boys throwbacks with friends, belting out Disney songs with your kids, or just laughing your way through a late-night solo session, Apple Music Sing now feels like a feature that justifies the Apple TV's price tag by adding a fun, interactive dimension no other streaming box offers. And when you think about Apple's strategy, it's clear. They want Apple TV to be more than passive entertainment. They want it to be interactive, social, and dynamic. A centerpiece not only for movies, but for experiences. 
Another highlight of tvOS 26 is its new screensavers, something many users underestimate until they see it in action. Since the very first Apple TV, aerial screensavers have been one of the most beloved hidden gems. Showcasing stunning footage of Earth from space, city skylines, underwater life, and more. And with each software update, Apple has quietly expanded this library, making your idle screen a work of art rather than wasted pixels. Now with tvOS 26, Apple introduces breathtaking new footage from India. With aerial shots of Goa's coastline, Kerala's lush landscapes, and other cultural landmarks, broadening the global collection further, but the real breakthrough is personalization. For the first time ever, you can curate which screensavers you see, hiding categories you dislike, for example, removing underwater if you prefer landscapes, or even filtering down to specific clips you enjoy the most, essentially turning your Apple TV into a personalized art gallery or ambient relaxation screen, which is especially powerful for households that often leave the TV on in the background during meals, gatherings, or when showcasing the home. Apple's attention to detail here shows that even something as simple as a screensaver becomes part of the broader vision of making Apple TV feel tailored to you, not generic. Profiles also see a major overhaul in tvOS 26, solving one of the biggest annoyances for households that share a single device. While profiles have existed for a while, they were clunky, often requiring multiple manual sign-ins across apps. But now tvOS 26 introduces a smarter profile system that presents a clean profile selection screen whenever the Apple TV wakes or lets you bypass it for single user households. And more importantly, Apple is giving developers the ability to tie apps directly to Apple IDs, meaning that when you switch to your profile, your streaming apps, Apple Arcade games, Apple Music playlists, and even recommendations automatically adjust to your Apple account without mixing with family members' data which eliminates those awkward situations where your Netflix is full of kids' shows or your Apple Arcade leaderboard is cluttered by your roommate's scores. This creates a seamless, personalized environment where the Apple TV truly feels like your device, even if it's shared across multiple people, and it makes setup for new users faster than ever. Since apps now auto-link to the profile's Apple ID by default, this is the kind of feature that quietly but dramatically improves everyday usability especially in large households or shared living spaces. Beyond the headline features, tvOS 26 comes packed with smaller but meaningful improvements that round out the update. Siri is now faster and more consistent with the version on iPhone and iPad, making voice search and commands more natural. The home app gains tighter matter support, making your Apple TV an even stronger smart home hub for controlling lights, locks, and thermostats. Now let's put tvOS 26 into context by comparing it to previous versions. tvOS 24 was a fairly minor update that focused mostly on stability and bug fixes. tvOS 25 brought small enhancements like improved multi-user support and incremental design tweaks. But tvOS 26 is the first time in years where Apple has delivered a major, multi-pronged update that changes how you use the Apple TV on a daily basis. So, when you put it all together, tvOS 26 is not a small step, but a major leap forward, making the Apple TV 4K more than just a streaming box. It is now your personalized media hub, your karaoke machine, your art gallery, your smart home controller, your family's entertainment switchboard, and your bridge to the wider Apple ecosystem, unified under the sleek liquid glass design language that makes it feel modern, immersive, and truly Apple. Yes, cheaper devices exist, but they can't match the integration polish, or multifunctional potential that tvOS 26 delivers, and the fact that this is a free update makes it all the more valuable. If you already own an Apple TV HD or Apple TV 4K, you can download tvOS 26 today and immediately transform your living room experience. Whether you care most about Dolby Atmos sound, karaoke fun, beautiful screensavers, faster profiles, or just a cleaner design that gets out of your way, and in doing so, Apple has once again reminded the world that it isn't just about selling devices, it's about building an ecosystem where every product from your iPhone to your television works together in harmony to create something greater than the sum of its parts. And tvOS 26 proves that the living room is no exception.